so they say Dance for me, dance for me, dance for me, oh, oh. I've never seen anybody do the things you do before Relationship chit chat. How about that? So, today we want to talk about a know it all. Now, I've had people tell me that I was a know it all, and that wasn't in a nice way. And I had to say, I do know a lot about a lot of things, but I don't know everything about everything. So, in my life, I had to grow up early. I, I, I left home when I was 17, and so I've been pretty much on my own since then. Now, I'm not saying I haven't been in relationships with other people. I, I, you know, I've been married. But in the times, and other times, and, and during the times of those, I had to depend on myself pretty much my whole life. So I had to learn a lot about a lot of different things. Take it for instance for you. I went to see my grandmother this past weekend. And uh, she lives with my aunt. And they have some chickens. And they asked me, do you, do you know these are hens or roosters? And so I told them, you know, what I thought about it. And why I thought, you know, that, that what I thought. And uh, my granny says, how do you know so much about chickens?
Every time you think somebody's being a know-it-all, think, hey, maybe they just got a lot of life experience. And maybe they're a person that's interested in a lot of things. Not necessarily because they're a know-it-all. So y'all have a good day, and I'll talk to you later.